YouTube, this is Guy from Sky to HD, and today we're gonna go see Dunkirk in IMAX 3D. So let's go. Okay, so this is the poster of the movie that we're gonna go see today. Are you guys ready? I even found on my minion shirt for this year's movie today. That's nice. Alright, here we are at the theater. Not to have two in emoji movies coming out. Okay, so we'll tell you how it is when we're all done. Bye. Dunkirk is released by Warner Bros. and is written and directed by Christopher Nolan, who also bought us the Dark Knight trilogy and Inception. It stars Tom Hardy, who played Bane in The Dark Knight Rises, as RAF Pirate Farrier. Sylvan Murphy, the Scarecrow from the Dark Knight Trilogy as the Shivering Soldier. Kenneth Branagh as Commander Bolton. Mark Rylands as Mr. Dawson. Theon Whitehead as Tommy. And Barry Keegan as George. First of all, I have to say Dunkirk is a cinematic masterpiece. I was lucky enough to watch it on IMAX and most of the movie shot in 70 millimeters. And the aerial scenes are breathtaking, real, and without any CGI. Dunkirk takes place during the evacuation of Dunkirk, France, which occurred between May 26 to June 4, 1940, after French, British, and Belgium troops were forced to retreat from Nazi Germany troops. The movie begins with British troops being warned by the Germans that they are surrounded. They are picked off by the sniper fire, but one of them, Tommy, makes it safely to the beach where the evacuation is taking place. As hundreds of thousands British and Allied troops await evacuation, Tommy and another quiet soldier, who we later learn is a French soldier disguised as a British soldier, try over and over to evacuate Dunkirk. As the troops await evacuation, they along with Navy evacuation ships are constantly attacked by German planes and submarines. The signature Christopher Nolan music score plays non-stop throughout the movie and it keeps a heart pounding throughout the film as we sit on the edge of our seats. Dunkirk is massively shown from three different viewpoints with three different type frames. Tommy and our troops during the week. Mr. Dawson and the civilian support fleet in a day. And the amazing aerial flights in an hour. When Winston Churchill calls in for civilian help, Mr. Dawson, Pierre, and George set out to help during the evacuation. On their journey, they can all see the devastation ahead of them as they move forward. They come upon a shipwrecked, shivering soldier, Murphy, who tries everything he can to force the crew back to England. In the, pro in the process, George is mortally injured and blinded. The movie shifts back and forth from all three intertwining stories with my favorite being the exciting aerial dogfight scenes with Tom Hardy and Jack Loudon. The fight scenes are so realistic since no phony CGI is used. George's death was one of the many sad parts of the movie, but earlier, George mentions he wanted his name in the paper to make his dad proud. And thanks to Peter, that happens. 
back to Tom Hardy's role. Having run out of fuel and forced to attempt a landing without the use of his engine. Hardy shoots down one last German plane before gliding to a stop. Where he then defiantly sets his plane on fire before being captured by German forces. His capture is less a sign of defeat as is it a prelude of the resistance and eventual victory to come. In the end, we learn that the victory came in being able to evacuate troops needed for the long war ahead. The movie is both sweeping with action, cinematic wonder, and a powerful music score, as well as the movie being intimate with us all connecting with the various likable characters. I give Dunkirk a 10 out of a possible 10, and the tragedy wouldn't be if this movie doesn't win Best Picture, Best Director, and Best Screenplay at Academy Awards. Thank you. Where are we going? Dunkirk. Look at that. There's no hiding from this sun. We have a job to do. If we go there, we'll die. see it from here. What? Home. Out of the theater, and this is and this is a little poster right here. So hope you hope you guys liked the movie, and as much as we do. Um. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more fun videos. And we will see you guys next time. Bye.